How's it going everybody? Jeff Zaylor with Zaylor Properties here to give you your April update. Yes, we're in May. We always give you the market update the month after. So market's getting hot uh, and so is the temperature, right? So we'll, as always, just talk about single family residences only. If you're interested in condos and townhomes, let us know we can run a separate report for you. But for the month of April, our median house price actually stayed the same as it did from, uh, from the month of March. We were at 300,000. And of note, three of the last four months and four of the last six or seven months, the, that median price has remained 300,000. Doesn't seem like we can get over that hurdle, which is interesting to watch, but we're at, back at 300,000 right on the dot as a median. For the average, we're at about 344,000 uh, for the month of, of April. Both of those numbers, when you compare to April of 2018, right between three and 4% of an annualized increase. That's about what I've been telling people here that we're gonna see between three and 7% for this year. So that, that doesn't surprise me, doesn't shock me. It's right in that range. Uh, the number of homes that were on the market as of April 30th was 8,552. That's a 46% increase from the year before. This shouldn't sound unusual, right? It's been the same trend month after month. Inventory is higher than it was before. Sales volume is, is a little bit lower, but the values are holding steady. Uh, and in fact, the, the number of sales for single family homes for April was 2,878. That was one off of where it was in April of 2018. That was 2,879. Really interesting, right? Almost the exact same number April to April. What I do like to see though, is every single month so far this year, our sales have actually increased every month. We didn't even have that last year. So that's interesting to note. Uh, median days on market, we actually went down, which shows that homes are selling faster. We went from 33 uh, in January down to 25 days uh, as an, a median. Now that's still a hundred percent, hundred and eight percent increase over last uh, this time last year. So things are taking a little bit longer to sell, but you're still 25 days. You're still under a month. If you look at the average, it was 46 days. That's about a 53% increase. It was about 30 days about a year ago. Months of inventory. My favorite stat, we all know this is 3.2 months. Again, we've been in that three, 2.9 to 3.2, 3.3 all year. So while we're kind of maintaining that, that uh, range, which is good, we're obviously still higher, right? We were at 1.9 months at the beginning of last year. So we've seen more inventory and a little bit longer to sell, but still 3.2 months, what do I say? We're definitely still in the seller's market. Um, last stat for overall, we had about $991 million in total volume for April. That was very similar to about the same time as last year. And just like our number of sales, each, each month this year so far, the volume has actually gotten higher and higher, which was not the case last year. So I still think we're in a, a strong market. Uh, rates are still really low, so our buyers are getting uh, more advantages. They have more homes to choose from, so they're not competing with everybody else. Great story, just talking about the inventory. We actually had a client that just bought his first home, closed escrow last week. We first started looking for a home for him last year, around this time when the market was insane. We were writing offers for full price. We were writing for offers for 5,000 more. We were writing offers for 7,000 more. We weren't even getting counter offers. Um, he was just getting rejected because the market was so crazy. Fast forward a year from, you know, he, he decided to renew his lease and started looking again this spring. His income went up a little bit, so we were actually able to look for a slightly higher price point, and guess what? The house he fell in love with, we wrote one offer, we had a small counter offer, and that was it. And he got into the house of his dream. So congratulations, you know who, who you are. Um, glad to see that the market has, you know, the market change has affected you in a positive manner. We did this last month, it was kind of fun. So our median price, our average price is 350,000, right? It's about $170 a foot. Took about a month to sell, right? About 25, 40, actually about 46 days. So what does that actually get you? Okay, so we did this last month. Here is what a home that sold for about what is average would have gotten you this month. This home in Henderson is about 2,095 square feet. So just under 2,100 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half bath to a three car garage. It sold for 345,750, which is almost spot on to what the average sales price was. It sold for $165 a square foot. The average is 170. And that home took 43 days on the market to sell. Our average was about 46 days on market. So if you wanna know what Las Vegas, what you can get for your money for average, 
this is your home in Henderson. Beautiful home, as you can see, some of it's been redone inside. I think I got one picture on there that shows what it looks like inside. But really nice home, good size lot, good neighborhood uh, of Henderson. So, you, you know, for an average price here, you can still get a great home. That's it for this uh, market update. If you have any questions, you can always get a hold of us at 702-903-2735. You can always email me at info at zaylorproperties.com. And to keep in touch and watch more of our videos, make sure you hit the subscribe button below. Take care.